What is up guys, PCHD here and today we've got episode number 4 of Making Akin Fenwell Famous. You'll be able to see in the background now uh, just me going into the first game while we do go over a couple of things. First off, the winner of the giveaway from last episode was Peter McNamara. I can apologize for saying your name wrong but you can see there the random number and he won. So if he wants to just message me on Xbox or via YouTube personal message or Twitter, uh, that's at BeachHD, then you'll be able to go and collect your 50k coins from last episode and you'll see from here we go into the game and start building up see if I can film I can get you any coins this episode as well because we now go 3-0 up just there and that was a pretty nice goal on the little half volley volley type thing but anyway, if you want to buy yourself some coins, you can, you know, go and uh, grab yourself some beast players like Akin Fenwa. <laughs> but he does manage to grab a goal there, even so. Go and check out hdfutcoins.com. You can use Beach, B E C H, to get yourself 5% off any purchases on Xbox, PlayStation, or PC. Just use it in the promo code area to get yourself that 5% off. So, 300 likes on this video, guys. That would be amazing if we can get that. Then there will be a episode of As Informed As It Gets out tonight at 8 p.m. So this should go up at 9 a.m. So smash that like button. You can see we've won the first game 5 0 after 90 minutes. I can film well, grabbed one goal. So that's 5k in the giveaway pot for later on. Hollands is who we introduced to the squad next to uh, almost come towards the end of this Gillingham squad that we're trying to build. I think there's only one or two more players left to add in there. And we come up against a, you know, a half gold, half bronze. So it's still more or less a starter squad with a, a couple of like add ins there. And we go into this second game, you know, pretty hopeful. It was a pretty simple game, to be fair. I can film what goes through just wide of the post. Pretty unlucky. But straight from that, he has a goal kick and kicks it straight to me. And I give it a cross, of course. I can film what, pow, 2-0. Uh, 1-0, but two giveaway pots. So that's 10k in the giveaway pot. Uh, we can go through on then 42 minutes in. He gets a little bit lucky with a rebound. And then just, oh, just a tiny, tiny bit out. And that could have been a pretty nice fucking goal. Akin Femmo goes through again. What's he going to do? A nice casual chip. 45 minutes in to make it a 15k in the giveaway pot. I don't, his goal to game ratio is absolutely amazing. I'm not even joking. He must be on, you know, for me now, at least like 10, 10 games played, 15 goals or whatever. He's just so good. I wasn't expecting it at all. But we're in the 54th minute, he goes through and he's just hit the post, isn't able to collect up the rebound as the keeper's just beasting it out there. What a class keeper. We go through again, Akin Fenwa, is he going to grab himself a hat-trick? He does. So that times to the giveaway amount for that hat-trick. And it also means that I have unlocked myself one more of the full attribute cards for Akin Fenwa when we hit Division 1. So that's all good for me when I want two of those all together. Alan's going to cross this one into Akin Fenwa again and pow! He's just not stopped scoring. Is that his fourth? I think that might be his fourth goal of this episode. Um, but anyway, that wraps it up to make it 4-0. And we are, you know, well on our way in this division. I think this is division... Yeah, it's possibly division 8, I think. But anyway, we're able to introduce a new player. It's going to be a centre-back whenever I decide to go and click on it over here. Come on. There we go. Davis is the centre-back. 64 pace, 60 defending, 59 heading. 200 coins. We're not really splashing the cash. You can't really splash the cash with a Gillingham squad anyway. And from there, we're able to move on into another match. And this time, the opponent's got a full bronze team. So it's... I can't really tell if it is better than the last one because he has full chemistry um, with, you know, obviously full French squad. But um, I, can't, I honestly can't even remember the score. We're going to have to leave it with me with this. We go and tramp it for the first goal. Just eight minutes in. <laughs> it's just, oh, God, we are terrible. It's just, you know, sweating to get through these divisions. Um, but, you know, we watch the replays. We try and get him mad. And eventually this madness pays off. That's absolute cracker from Alan as that hits the back of the net. And from there, I think we're going to see a little bit of a rage quit. And there we have it. Connection lost. That's 2-0. And we are 9 points in this division. So I decided, you know, that was a pretty short game. Only lasted 38 minutes. We're going to introduce a new player. And we're going to have one final game. Which is why there's four games included in this episode. Left back Martin goes into that squad. I think, bar one more player, then that'll be the squad Gillingham done. But let's move on to the next game. He's got, again, a starter squad. I think it's pretty much a starter squad. He might have brought one or two players in. Not sure. 67 chemistry, and I was, you know, pretty certain I was going to absolutely batter this guy. And we have to see what happens now. Weston's bombing it down the line. 91 pace. Whips in a cross. Now that bicycle kick, though, into the bottom of the net. Uh, delicious goal to go through. One of the highlights of the goal so far, to be fair. Akin Femmer goes through, capitalises on a mistake, but just smacks it wide with his left foot. He has enough trouble scoring with his right foot, so we'll let him off. But um, 31 minutes in, we whipped him across back post. Akin Femmer's free. It's just gone wide again, inches out. 
Uh, but 34 minutes, you know. McDonald's through. He's, he's, McDonald's a bit surprising. He scored some nice goals. That's a delicious goal. But you just don't expect it because he's just like your average non shiny bronze striker. Uh, fair enough for him, though, as he whips one through. I think he's going to play it through to Akin. He's going to pop one in just wide of the post. Getting closer is this episode. This, uh, well, this game, effectively. Not managed to grab one yet. 47 minutes in, he has his first little chance. And I go through again. Akin Fenwa, what's he going to do? Passes it in. Nice little skill. Boom. Still unable to score. It's getting so much closer and closer and closer, but it's just missing that tiny bit every single time. A little bit of skill, a little bit of jam, and then we just smack it onto the post, rebound to the keeper's hands, and he's collected it up. Still sticking at 2-0. If this was against a goal team, I'd probably be winning and scored all those. Akin Fenwell's going through 71 minutes, and goal. Takes the jackpot to 50,000 coins so far. Now it's all going good for you guys at the end of this little episode. Let's stay tuned. Um, he just smacks that one to the top corner. No chance was the keeper going to be saving that. Now we go on to the 75th minute. I can find what's picked up. Edge of the box. Oh my god, what a goal. That is such a class goal from a bronze striker with 45 shot or something like that. Terrible shot accuracy. Now, I'm not even sure if that was a finesse or just a power shot here, but lovely to the bottom corner. And we'll go through again with Allen, 18 minutes in. He's going to whip that to Akin Fenwell's head. Just in again. I think that was Akin Fenwell, was it? We have seen that. Yeah, it was indeed. 55,000 coins. And it's all going good. You can see there, a bunch of goals. Hat-trick again, some Akin Fenwell. And I think we've guaranteed the win. We've pretty much promoted from that division. But from there, that is going to be the end of the episode, guys. We're just going to add in the central midfielder, Smith. Which I think does complete the squad, so there'll be a new squad coming next episode, guys. Now, we did manage to make 55,000 coins, so if this gets 300 likes by the 8pm target, then you uh, will be able to go and have your chance of winning this 55,000 coins. You need to follow me on Twitter, at BeachHD. You need to obviously like and favourite the video if you can. Uh, if you can just get the 300 likes, of course, that's when the giveaway will start. And you need to say in the comment section down below, you need to vote who you think will finish in the top four, the full Your Squad top four. Uh, the Premier League at the end of the season. So put hashtag Beaches Babes in the comment left with your you know number one, Chelsea number two, whoever, Arsenal three, uh, whatever. So just go and put that in the comments and I'll randomly select one that I agree with uh, at the end of the next episode, guys. So remember to drop that like, subscribe to me if you haven't already. I'll see you on the next video, guys. Bye-bye.